Hey everyone, Carm. You can hear back with a new video. Rock, stop, stop, stop. It's not for you. Hey, hey, Roxy. It's not your toy. That's not yours. No, go over there. Go over there. Watch the camera. Hey, stop. That's not yours. That's not yours. Go lay down. Lay down. Stay. Thank you. Anyway, with that uh, out of the way, we got some new Bakugan Battle Planet to unbox after my Bakugan bay hunting uh, and other hunting that I did. Uh, hopefully I posted the Bakugan hunting before this one. You might get three posts in a row in that case. Because uh, I want to do these two Bakugan individually and so I just put them together because I might get more views like that. Uh, maybe not. I don't know. Anyway, guys, we got ourselves here, the new Bakugan Battle Planet. So I thought first, why not unbox the Ultra Bakugan Chaos Garganoid. The one with the level 3 dip level, level three difficulty. Dog will approve. Do you approve? You approve? Yeah, she, she stopped. Stop. My ears. Go over there. Go over there. Go lay down. Go lay down. Roxy, go lay down. Thank you. Please, no, please stop messing with this. Oh no, tripod. Ugh. Technical difficulties. Oh, I'm not gonna. Yeah, I'm not gonna edit that out. Anyway, let us actually get on to the unboxing here of the actual product. I can get my scissors. So, as I said, it is level 3 difficulty and it's an ultra. I might pause the video and look up the video again that Battle Planet actually posted. No, it's not yours. Stop. That Battle Planet actually posted on how to fold this. Or I might jump cut edit it. And I don't feel like jump cut edits. Ugh. I, god dang it, I really want to keep the packaging though. I mean, do I want to keep the packaging? I might, I might. I might not keep the packaging for Battle Planet and stuff. Because I prefer keeping the packaging for my other stuff. And since these are always different. Uh, yeah, I'm probably, yep, yeah, I can't open this without tearing up the packaging. Ah, uh, dang it. I have to open this without turning up the packaging and messing up any of the stuff. And that's impossible. Oof. Well, oof it. Oof it. Ah. At, least I know, like, at least I know it comes with some cards. Roxy, it ain't yours. What did I say? This ain't yours. It's not yours. You can probably play with the broken up box when I get done. Okay, we got the back of it and the cards. Here are the cards. We can focus. There we go. Let's uh, check the cards out real quick. Come on. There we go. Any cards? There's two cards. Okay. Let's see. We get Garganoid Ultra with a B power of 400 and a critical hit of 3. And this is the Chaos version of it. And these cards aren't that thick. These are thinner than Yu-Gi-Oh! And I think in Pokemon cards. We also come with an action card. Blinding Gleam. Minus three critical to an enemy Bakugan. Or plus three critical to one of your Bakugan. It's also got a simple Pegatrix. And a electricity point of that. Hmm. That's an action card. Okay. Put that over to the side. Oh, look at this. Oh, this must be like the, that sheet I saw in like some of the first Bakugan, not Bakugan, Beyblade when they started releasing. It tells you which ones come in there, which ones are going to get released. Yep, there it is. Okay. Oh, it even comes with an instruction sheet for Garganoid. That is very useful. Don't know if they did this for all Bakugan, but I'm assuming they're doing this for all the Ultra Bakugan, because that makes sense. Not every kid is going to understand how to fold it properly. Anyway, it looks like we can see all the Bakugan here. Also comes with all the factions. Arliss and Diamond seem to be very rare. Okay. You got the Nilius, Mantanoid, Fangzor, Serpentes, Pegatrix, Dragonoid, Hydrus, and Trox. Then over here, which must be level 2, a different version of Trox and Krakilius. And next is another version. These must be the Ultras. Okay. So, yep. Here we have level one, level two, and level three. So level three must be all the ultras. You got hydras, yeah, all the all of them. 
actually really cool. Hmm. I don't know, but these are also part of this little right here. I just need to see it. Either way, that's cool. Uh, this seems to be, what is this? Is this a rule? Yep, these are the rules. Sort of. Probably gonna need to buy like a... Let's see, what do we get here? The brawl. Yeah, it's, it's a rule sheet here. That's the example of Dragon Boy has. Okay, well, we're not gonna focus too much on that. Also, hold on a sec. Where are my back of cores? Okay, here they are. Back of cores, as we get. These are basically the new gate cards. towards each other okay and the new gate cards you got one with the fist and one with the shield on the back of it it says plus three critical back of this one says plus 400 b power for chaos and pyrus okay then put that here and finally to the absolute main attraction of this the chaos gargonoid if i can properly get it out without damaging it Okay, let's, let's, come on, come on, come on, all this left is the tail, there we go, yeesh, that is a big Bakugan, that's a really big Bakugan, my god, that's really big, so let me grab one of the old Bakugan real quick, stay, Roxy, stay right there. Like I said, the thing, the thing, you know, is you don't, you don't get this. The biggest other battle gun I have in the old generation is my Luma Growl. And when you look at these two open, there's a superior size difference. Anyway, like I said, this is Chaos. And they changed Chaos's coloring from a gold and yellow, or I mean gray and yellowish look, to blue and white. I'm fine with that. I'm, I kind of prefer the old one, because it... Does it look more like a light element? This looks more like ice elements. But, eh, I'm fine with that. Roxy, please leave this stuff alone. This, this ain't your stuff. This ain't your stuff, Roxy. Please leave it alone. I don't need you coming. <laughs> go lay back and go, Roxy. Okay. Well, I guess we'll just be in the shots for a bit. Anyway, looking at the instructions, let's see. So let's fold this down. Okay, wow, that was very difficult, and I have to rewatch the entire video on the Battle Planet uh, YouTube channel in order to figure out how to do it. But dang, it feels big. If we get my Ventus Luma Brow here, we fold it up. Here's Ventus Luma Rowl, and here's the new Bakugan. You can see the size difference. It's a very considerable size difference in, like, the Bakugan. And like I said, it's because of the whole thing like that. Anyway, let's do a brawl. There we go. 
Oh, I probably should have zoomed in and did that, but oh well, I'm not holding that thing back up again on this camera, as I've already done enough of that. Let's see, anyway, we get this on here, and then we see what the thing is, and the, it's a plus three critical on here. That's how it would work, plus the, and I don't have any cards and stuff like that, except for the two cards it gave me. Anyway, there you go, guys, that was the unboxing I did of the Chaos Ultra Garganoid. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a like and comment section below. And I'll see you guys. See you guys. See you guys. Later. Peace out. Watch your vlogs and do whatever you have to do to hit that like and subscribe button. Show your support for the channel, especially if you're new. Anyway, just for the hex of it, let, let's put let's put the Ventus Luma Growl on here. Yeah. Anyway, peace out. And I'm gonna hate editing this video tonight. Oh boy, I'm gonna hate it.